Hi, and welcome to Pollywog Lagoon. Today, we're going to be opening up a couple surprise eggs and reading this PJ Masks book, Gecko Saves Christmas. We have some special guests, Lightning McQueen, Mater, Smokey, and Cruz Ramirez. Hope you're super excited to get started. Okay, guys, before we open up these surprise eggs, don't forget to subscribe. And please let us know down in the comments below what else you might like to see. Which egg do you think we should do first? Mm. Cruz Ramirez wants to do the yellow egg. Mm -hmm. Okay, yellow egg coming right up. Yellow egg. <clears throat> oh my goodness! It's Catboy! Hey, Catboy! Owlet! And Gecko! Yay, we're so excited you could join us! All right, Mater and Smokey, there's another egg left to open, the blue one. Let's go ahead and see what's inside. I wonder who could be, oh my goodness, it's Romeo and Luna Girl. Oh man, I wonder what they're going to be up to in this video. <gasps> dun, dun, dun. <laughs> Here you go, Gecko, take a ride on Smokey. Kind of like riding a little board. Hmm. Catboy's turn. Before we read our PJ Masks book, Catboy has something cool to show you all. Okay, Catboy, what is it? Oh, let's check this out. Oh, how cool! That was such a neat surprise, Catboy. Thank you so much for sharing. Do you know what time it is? It's story time! Gecko saves Christmas! Gecko saves Christmas. It's Christmas Eve, and Connor, Greg, and Amaya are ice skating. Well, sort of. As Amaya and Connor glide along the ice, Greg slips and slides and crashes into a wall. I'm not any good at this, he groans. We'll help you, says Connor. Just try. Skating is a part of Christmas, like the tree. Amaya nods. Yeah, with all its lights and decorations. What lights and decorations, asks Greg. Amaya and Connor look up at the tree. It's bare. Even the star at the top is gone. This is a job for the PJ Masks. PJ Masks, we're on our way into the night to save the day. Connor becomes Catboy, Amaya becomes Owlet, and Greg becomes Gecko. Whoever took those decorations went really high. We need to get up high too, says Catboy at headquarters. To the Owl Glider, says Owlet. Up in the Owl Glider, the heroes spot Luna Girl in the sky. Gasping geckos, she's taking everyone's presents with her Luna magnet, says Gecko. If we could get her Luna board, she wouldn't be able to reach the chimneys. Good idea, Gecko, says Catboy. Let's go! Owlette pushes a button on the owl glider and a gust of wind forces Luna Girl off of her Luna board. <laughs> Catboy jumps out of the owl glider and chases Luna Girl. Ah! Owlette runs to grab the Luna board, but Luna Girl summons her moths. Owlet, look out, shouts Gecko, but it's too late. The moths catch Owlet. Quick, Gecko, she says, fly the Luna board away from Luna Girl. Gecko is nervous. I've never ridden a Luna board before, he says, climbing on. I won't be able to do it. The Luna board slips out from under Gecko's feet and goes flying right to Luna Girl. Whoosh, oh no! So long, kitty Luna Girl, says the cat boy. I'm me out of here. The moths let go of Owlette and the heroes meet up with one another. Gecko, are you okay? asks Catboy. Yes, says Gecko, but I knew I wouldn't be able to fly the Luna board. Sorry. It's okay, says Catboy. Let's just go after Luna Girl. Owlette, you fly and we'll follow you from the ground. Owlette soon catches up with Luna Girl. 
Why don't you just give those presents back, Owla asks. Because I don't want to, replies Luna Girl. Come and get them if you think you can. Owla rushes at Luna Girl, but Luna Girl is ready for her. She uses her Luna Magnet to stop Owlette. Super Cat Jump, Catboy yells as he races off to help Owlette. He grabs onto the Luna board as Luna Girl tries to shake him off. She lets go of the Luna Magnet. Owlette is free, but now she is falling through the air. No! Gecko, help, cries Catboy. Gecko rushes over and catches Owlette before she crashes into the roof. Meanwhile, Catboy is still hanging on to the Luna board as Luna Girl dips and dives through the sky, trying to make him lose his grip. Owlette, what do we do, Gecko asks. I'm too dizzy to help, she tells him. You need to jump on the Luna board again to help Catboy. But I'm no good at riding yet, Gecko tells her. But Owlette knows the truth. You don't know if you're any good at it yet because you haven't really tried. You can do it. You're right, Owlette, says Gecko. I've got to at least try to save Catboy. It's time to be a hero. Super Gecko camouflage, Gecko cries as he runs up a building. Luna Girl and Catboy whiz by on a Luna board. And Gecko jumps and lands right next to Luna Girl. Luna Girl is so surprised that she falls off the Luna board and lands on the roof. Gecko and Catboy are still on the Luna board. Gecko swerves as he gets used to flying it. Don't panic, Gecko, or we'll crash, Catboy tells him. Right, says Gecko, careful. I just bring it down slowly. Gecko makes a smooth landing on the roof. He and Catboy are safe. Great job, Gecko. Way to go, says Catboy. I knew you'd get the hang of it. You just had to give it a try. Gecko turns to Luna Girl. It's over, he says. We've got your Luna board, so you can't steal any more presents. Luna Girl frowns. It's not fair. I never get a real Christmas. I'm just here by myself. That gives Gecko an idea. Why don't you spend the rest of Christmas Eve with us? We've got to put up all these presents and decorations back away. You can help. Then we'll have Christmas together, says Catboy. What do you say? Okay, I guess, says Luna Girl. Gecko stands on the Luna board again. Then hop on. We're going to save Christmas. Together, the PJ Masks and Luna Girl go from chimney to chimney, returning Christmas presents. They even decorate the Christmas tree again. Isn't it beautiful, Luna Girl, Gecko asks. I guess, Luna Girl replies. But now Christmas really is over, and I don't get any presents. Oh, yes, you did, Catboy tells her. The PJ Masks have a present for Luna Girl. Luna Girl opens the box. I skates, she says, but I've never skated before. That's okay, says Gecko. Neither have I, but we'll get the hang of it. Come on, let's just try. Luna Girl and Gecko head onto the ice. At first, they are a little wobbly, but after a little practice, they get better. And then something magical happens. It starts to snow. Snow for Christmas, shouts Owlette. Catch a snowflake on your tongue, says Gecko. PJ Masks all shout hooray, because on Christmas Eve, we saved Christmas Day. Merry Christmas, everyone. Okay, Lightning McQueen and Cruz Ramirez, what do we have to do next? <gasps> it looks like we have some awesome ornaments here to open up and check out. hook right here and you can hang it on your tree here's Owlette and Gecko looks like there's just a few more Another Owlette, Catboy, and Gecko. Here's a big one. It's time to be a hero. <gasps> Look at it's Luna Girl and Romeo. Oh my goodness. And what's this one? Into the night to save the day. Gecko, Owlette, and Catboy. The end. Thank you so much for joining us today. I hope you had a great time opening up surprise eggs and reading this story, as well as 
checking out our sweet little surprise, Ice Skating Mouses. We'll see you again really soon. Bye-bye.